So we have the main event of payback for the WWE World Heavyweight Championship in a fatal four-way match. We had Roman Reigns going up against Randy Orton, going up against Dean Ambrose, facing the WWE World Heavyweight Champion Seth Rollins. And like everyone said, this match was chaotic. It was destructive. Everyone was going crazy. This match started off everyone brawling. Everyone went outside the ring. Dean Ambrose jumped aside. Um, did a dive outside the ring. Uh, Roman Reigns did a dive, like an Undertaker type dive outside the ring. Everyone was down and out, and but then the, pretty much this match turned into a four on three match. It was Seth Rollins, JJ Security, and Kane going against Randy Orton, Dean Ambrose, and Roman Reigns, and pretty much the whole match of them um, four on three, them going back and forth. JJ Security taking out and Kane taking out uh, the three guys, pretty much trying to get. Uh, Seth Rollins to retain the WWE World Heavyweight Champion, so neither of the guys would win the championship uh, since Orton since turned on uh, the Authority, and obviously Roman Reigns and, and Dean Ambrose are not even a part or associated with Authority because they don't Authority doesn't like them, and they don't like them, so that's that. Um, pretty much they went at it. Finally, uh, Kane got taken out, the J&J Security got taken out, and then this is the part where the return of the Shield for one minute only, where they teamed up on Randy Orton, and put him through a whole uh, table. Oh, it was awesome. And then Rollins was a little happy. Like, yeah, the Shield back together. We're all reunited. I'm going to retain my championship. But now that wasn't the case because Ambrose and Rollins, Ambrose and Reigns turned on Rollins, threw him on the table. Kane tried to attack him. They, uh, um, Ambrose and uh, Reigns powerbombed Kane, um, threw the table not once, not twice, hit it, hit it, hit the table. Am um, Rollins on the table. They hit the power bomb on Rollins. The table doesn't break. They hit it again. Rollins goes through it. King goes through it. It's a it's a destruction. Then them two face off. They get in the ring. They do like a big stare down of Ambrose versus Reigns. It's gonna happen. It's going down. It's finally gonna take place. Um, they're going at it. It was good. Um, uh, Rollins um, Reigns almost gets the pin with the Superman punch and the spear. Rollins comes in, breaks up the pin. Orin comes in and then King comes in, attacks everyone. Um, RKO on J and J security. Everyone everyone's down. And then the end came where um, pretty much Rollins uh, comes in, takes everyone out, face Dean Ambrose. Dean Ambrose is about to get the win, but uh, Rollins reverses um, into a pedigree. And 1-2-3 victory, Rollins retains the WWE World Heavyweight Championship. Thanks to the help of Kane, thanks to the help of J&J Security. And uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, Triple H comes out. Looks like he's about to like be mad at Rollins. Hey, what do you use my, view, my move for? But then congratulates him. They, um, he, uh, uh, Triple H holds Rollins' hands high, and uh, there you go. That's the end of it. And Rollins retained the championship. Overall, decent show. Main event was fun to watch, and that was it. So there you have it. Rollins retained the championship. Uh, maybe Kane turns on Rollins tomorrow night. Who knows what's going down? But um, I think Rollins will keep his belt all the way up until when Brock comes back, and then Brock will be the guy to finally uh, beat Seth Rollins. And uh, win the world, WWE World Heavyweight Championship. But there you have it. Uh, this pay per view. If you missed it, go watch the Cena match. Go watch that match, the main event. Go watch the tag match. That's pretty much all you need to do. So there you go. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. That is all.